Oh, hey, Justin Craig, your friendly neighborhood equipment operator with Katie Fire Department. Today we're going to discuss some proper methods of how to dispose of medications that are being unused in your home. Come on, let's go inside and get some more information. Howdy, my name is Matt Andre. I'm a lieutenant with Katie Fire Department. Some of the ways you might wind up with extra medications in your house are if you change to another medication, if you have extra medication following a procedure or surgery, or if you have a death in the family and medications are left over. These are just some of the ways that you might wind up with extra meds in your house. I bet this is a way that some of you dispose of your medications at home. Unfortunately, this could be unsafe for you and your family. Hi, I'm Nathan, firefighter, Katie Fire Department. Did you know improper disposal of your medications can lead to children or pets getting into it, accidental usage, pills being sold illegally, and even your personal info getting stolen off the bottles. Let's go discuss some of the proper ways to dispose of a medication. Yeah, Doug, that work? You can call your primary care physician who prescribed the medications, and they can recommend safe ways to dispose of the medications. For assistance, you can go to this website. It's gonna show pharmacies in your area that participate in safe drug disposal programs. Or, for more useful information, visit the U.S. Food and Drug Administration's website. Thank you for watching this video. We hope that you found it very informative and that it helps you in the future. Please enjoy the rest of your day.